Hi there. Are you a risk taker? I have to confess, risk taking is not my nature. I like the sure, the proven, and the guaranteed. However, I recognize that this is necessary in leadership. Most people who are successful engage in some degree of risk taking. They made that risky investment. They pushed their product to a previously unexplored market. They registered for a tennis match deemed beyond their abilities. They pushed the level of chemicals beyond previous levels. You get the picture. When something needs to be explored, followers stand back and analyze what could be done with the problem, what should be done with the problem, and then wish someone would step forward and take that risk to see if the problem can be solved. Enter super leader, willing to take the risk. So who were some risk takers we have heard of? Thomas Edison, Ted Turner, Bill Gates, Ronald Reagan, and maybe tomorrow, leadership development classes will be saying your name in that list. Who knows? But you have to be willing to take a risk and push beyond the fear. For some people, taking a risk means getting up in front of their speech class and giving that first speech. For others, it means attempting that three-pointer just before the buzzer instead of going for that safe two points. My 18-year-old son took a risk. He has a business of selling homemade cookies at school. Seriously, he bakes them, not me. Today he came home and said, Mom, I have three agents who are now going to sell for me. I can triple my profit starting next week. What? I was filled with all kinds of questions and concerns, but he is willing to take the risk. And who knows, someday you might be sitting down at your kitchen table eating a J-bar and milk. Take a look at the assignment schedule and be sure to turn in your PowerPoint before you get too excited about spring break. Have a great day and a great spring break.